Courtney Myers Jones. I'm from Oakland, California. I ran track, yes, I ran track at University of Illinois. Um, I did track for 14 years of my life, so I continued it in college. Um, but I always knew when I was younger that I was going to go D1 just because our coaches like instilled that in us. They, the way that we had our workouts um, was the same as D1 college, how they um, ran their program. So we'll have like two lifts a day. Um, so two a day practices, one really early in the morning and then one throughout the day. We'll have our classes, everything really um, early so that means in the afternoon we were free for practice, so I had the same type of lifestyle since high school, really. So I was, um, I was really pl uh, proud of myself when I got accepted, but it was also something that I've been working towards since ninth grade. Being away from track has allowed me to do is dive into other aspects of creativity that I have, which I didn't know. Some things, you know, I have interests, and I'm like, okay, but now I have all the time in the world to really, like, explore those interests. So as of now, um, I'm really getting into film and documentaries, and I see myself working as a producer. So I'm devoting, like, all my time towards that. Um, so track hasn't really um, added itself in the equation anymore, mainly because I'm doing, like, real-life things that I wasn't able to do when I was running. Running was such a blessing, but it does take all of your time. Um, we had mandatory 10 hours of study hall, but we had practices that took about like seven hours. So like, do the math, like when do you really have like time to yourself? Because you still have to do, go to your appointments. You have, being an athlete, it's like just required to have appointments with your advisors because you travel and you miss school. So they want to make sure that you're on track. There's no questions. And then you have classes in the mornings and then you have two lifts. So it's like, when do you really have time to do anything? And then we leave on, most of the time we leave on Thursdays, and we're back on Sundays, sometimes Saturday nights, and then that's like the time you do all your homework and everything. And then we have also mandatory, um, we have to go to this place called Varsity. Varsity is athletes where we go to eat. So breakfast, lunch, and dinner, they provide meals, which was really cool. Um, and those are mandatory because they have like a certain diet that they follow and they want us to have that diet. So um, our, our life was really planned for us. From the time we woke up to the time we go to bed, it was like they knew what we were doing. And then since we missed things like career fairs that normal students get to go to or you know, job fairs and stuff like that, they have, um, we have our own like kind of network where um, the, the administrators on the, for the athletics will invite different people to come speak to us because like I said, we're gone most of the time. So we miss those things, but we have our own which um, I was really grateful for. Those are really cool. But being away from track has allowed me to do more things that I thought I would never possibly do. So I probably wouldn't go back as of now just because I'm really um, I'm comfortable exploring all the things that I've always wanted to do.